We've been on alert, high alert since the Met Department warned us about this um, depression that is heading our way. So all my supervisors when it comes to drains are all out making sure that we could clear as many uh, outlets as possible. Now some of the low-lying areas will definitely get some water and that's what we've been working on since Monday. Uh, if you notice the deluge that we have been getting, uh, especially since Tuesday, um, have us a little bit overwhelmed, but we are getting there. So that's the reason I'm out here this morning to make sure that uh, we could hear from the residents and we could actually see what is happening. All right, so we could get people on the ground to come out and do what needs to be done as quickly as possible. Now we're looking at certain areas that are quote unquote troublesome, including Port Loyola as one where you do have specific neighborhoods that are below the average water level and so is the same for parts of Belama. Um, in your assessment of these two communities, what are we looking at so far? Well, Belama, Port Loyola, certain areas in Collet, they've been underwater because of the, because of the basin-like uh, area that they have. Now, it's very, it's very difficult to, to drain those areas. Um, some people want us to fill the streets because they cannot get out of their houses and so on. What I am trying to do right now is to see how we could drain the area properly. Uh, you will notice that in certain areas, the water catchment areas have been, they have been filled up for lots and so on. Now, knowing that water will find its level, the water needs to go somewhere. So, hence the, the flooding of the streets and so on. Right? But the low-lying areas, that's what we are working on for this week. We are trying to make sure that these people don't get water into their houses.